So holy shit, they have done it again. This is season 19, perhaps becoming one of the greatest seasons ever. Episode 7, F Zappa 20 here again. Boy, it starts out, oh, what an intense ending, too. Before we get to that ending, it also began with Leslie. PC principal, that's the chick he's been yelling at every time they have an auditorium scene. Shut the fuck up, Leslie, or whatever he's saying, you know, whatever the deal is with that. So this time he gets the whole police there, the SWAT team, the captain, even Barb Brady, which leads to Barb Brady, of course, being the fuck up, coming in, shoots an unarmed minority six-year-old, a Latino-American. <laughs> you wondered how long it would be before they would touch on that. You know, they've always hit in current events and pop culture. This season, man, they're just taking it to the next level, though. So then, you know, as the episode's moving on, god damn, probably the hardest laugh I had throughout the episode. The kids were playing ninja. Kenny and Token started a ninja club, and then the club got a little bigger, and they're all playing ninja down at Soda Sopa, which has now been taken over by Homeless already. And the people confused them for ISIS. I mean, they look just like ISIS. You know, the black ninja outfits. People think they're, think they're ISIS. They're freaking out. The kids think they're cool because everybody's scared to fucking death of them. They actually talked to a guy from ISIS. Another moment where I just was fucking losing it. Cartman <laughs> wants to ask the guy, the official member of ISIS, you know, what he thinks is it problematic if there's a Jew in the group. Because, of course, Cartman wants Kyle out of the group. The guy in ISIS says, yeah, that's a huge problem, man. So then Cartman literally does <laughs> the can't touch this. They played can't touch this. Oh, they also dropped the NWA, fuck the police. There was no original songs. They went with can't touch this and fuck the police. So I don't know, between the kids being confused for ISIS, the homeless people and Soda Sopa already. You know, Randy had another great line. You know, they were all pissed off with the cops after Barb Brady shot that fucking kid. <laughs> He said they've only had a, they've had a Whole Foods for a month and they already don't need cops. But of course they did need cops because they thought it was ISIS as well. So I don't know, you know. Another just fucking classic episode. Seeing Bar Brady unmasked, no glasses, no badge, out of uniform. That was a big thumbs up. I believe that's the first time we've ever seen that, right? Am I wrong? I don't think so. I think that's the first time. They even made the comment here from the mayor that, you know, Bar Brady, things are changing around here. You're basically the last of a dying breed. It's time for you to go. I was thinking, oh no, I hope this isn't the end of Bar Brady. Just about everybody from the early seasons are gone. Things have changed. And it's pretty unbelievable, 19 seasons in. These guys might be hitting their prime right now. This could be the best season they've had. I've always been a big fan of season 7. But this one could top it. Alright, so I'm F Zappa 20. It was another fucking phenomenal episode. No song. You know, I'm sure I'm leaving some stuff out. I'm going to have to watch it again. You'll see it. You already watched it. All right, here we go. Check out the other ones. You know, I don't know if you've been watching these or not. Whatever you're into. I do some Game of Thrones shit, some pea fish stuff. Watch some other videos. Click on F Zappa 20 down there and check it out. All right, guys, that's it. Now you know the name. You know the show. They're just dominating, right? Am I wrong? This wasn't a fucking dud episode. This wasn't a, this wasn't a Morgan episode. We still didn't find out what happened to Glenn, though, unfortunately. And yes, I got another haircut. Fuck you.